Hi folks, welcome to another Kashkai video. Today is a one that I didn't really want to do, but we're having some issues. So yeah, we'll crack on to that in a sec. But as usual, I want to start the video with a big thank you to my members. They are Shane Cook, Darren Lynch, Aina Lund, and my newest member. Thank you very much, Matthew Reynolds. Welcome to you. If you'd like to join these guys, get these videos 24 hours early, get shout outs and videos as such, and more, including um, coming up, we are going to be doing giveaways from the end of August, which will be great fun. Just click on the join button below to find out what's available. Um, but yeah, let's crack on and I'll explain what this video is all about. So, I did a video not too long ago, which I shall put a link just there for, um, all about the issues that a lot of people have with the Nissan Connect Stereo. Now, it's not just the Qashqai, it's also the Duke, uh, the X-Trail, and basically any other Nissan that was fitted with the same stereo um, that we've got in our Qashqai J11s. Um, long story short, Nissan had a bit of a silly moment and affected something on one of their updates and it needed another update to fix that fault that they put into the system. Um, the update should have been free and initially it was but I've had a lot of people now messaging me, emailing me and putting comments in videos saying Nissan now say it costs and they want money for it which really winds me up because they've just changed their mind as such. It's potentially my fault because I've put this video out there. It's got a heck of a lot of people seeing it. Maybe Nissan are going, oh man, we're losing a lot of money here because you know it is labor, I suppose. If, if you have this update, it takes around an hour plus, maybe two hours in some cases. That's an hour or two hours of labor cost that they lose because it's free. So maybe Nissan are being a bit naughty and saying, you know, we're gonna start charging for this. And I think one person said to me that Nissan gave them the excuse that radio signal and radio waves have changed, therefore it's no longer covered by this uh, warranty as such. And then a lot of people are saying that because their Nissan is out of warranty, that it's apparently no longer uh, a free job. Other people are saying it's they've had it done for free, which is great, and it just seems to be purely down to who you get, get through to on the phone, which is a real shame. But anyway, so let's crack on with this video. Um, it's a relatively short one, but I wanna do a few no notes to the video. Um, my, I've got a smudge on my camera here, haven't I? Oh well. Um, yeah, so I am below this video in the description. I'm putting a link to my own Google Drive, which has got the files you need, as well as a guide on how to do it. But I'm going to say now, I'm going to put it in the description and I'm going to put it within the files that you download. I cannot be held responsible if anything goes wrong. Okay, there is a step by step guide. It's relatively easy if you follow it and give it the time and make sure that your car is running for the entirety of the update, for example. But what I'm saying is please, please do not attempt it if you have any worries or doubts about it, okay? Just keep niggling on at Nissan. They may eventually do it for free for you. Um, I'm not going to do a guide myself of how you do it because it's all within, this, within the paperwork or the download that's below. Um, but these are files that I've obtained and I've gone through myself and they're all, all legit and it should do the update for you, okay? So please do follow the guide and please do understand that I cannot be held responsible for any issues that you may have from this update. So that's kind of it for this video. Like I say, the files are below. Feel free to browse through them, browse through the um, how to, the tutorial guide for it. The tutorial is the Nissan tutorial that your dealership would have, your, your tech that works on your car would have exactly the same notes in front of them. So, you know, it's all there. It's not too gibberish. Just make sure you follow it step by step. If you're unsure, don't do it. That's all I'll say. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. Just a quick one, but hopefully it can help you guys out. Uh, and I shall see you in the next video. Thanks a lot.